there and welcome to um, another part of this cleaning my son's room episode. Uh, basically, uh, we started with sort of organising all his clothes, sorting out his wardrobe. We have um, cleaned the mirrors now um, and um, today I'm going to clean the walls. On another day, I'm going to get to the blinds and the fan and that will be the next time I need to redo his floors and stuff like that. In my life, it's just like yours. I'm busy. My house is not perfectly clean all the time. I'm a working mum and so things get done as they get done and sometimes that happens in multiple stages. But anyway, one of the best things that I've got, and you may have seen some of my videos before, on flat mops. Flat mops are awesome when it comes to cleaning walls and ceilings and difficult to reach places. So what I've got down here is just this bucket of um, detergent and water. Um, I just used that bucket actually when I made this previous video of when I cleaned the, the mirrors. So I can reuse this, it's still clean. So I'm... I'm just wetting this um, sponge for the flat mop. <clears throat> And I'm squeezing it out quite well as well. Now, my son actually turned his bed around. He likes to do that from time to time. Oh, I can just see that that painting is a bit crooked, but anyway, we'll fix that up. Um, so what you can't maybe able to see is these dark lines across, across his wall there where his bed head used to be and he was touching the walls and things like that. Now, I've painted... Um, most of the walls in this house so i can tell you when you've been the person to go around and paint your whole house you want to make sure you try and keep the paint and the walls in good condition the other thing is is it's something that people often neglect when they're cleaning they forget to look at the walls and clean the walls yet it makes such a difference when you do do it now this method is really quick um, i've just got a little bit of organic multi-purpose spray here and I'm just going to spray the area that needs to be cleaned. I then have this um, flat mop here. Now, I bought this one not so long ago from Bunnings. And I quite like this, actually. I'll show you. I think it cost about $35 Australian. So, um, but the good thing about it is that it's double sided. So you can clean with using one area and if that side gets too, um, too dirty, you can actually just flop it over. The other thing is, is sometimes when you're cleaning with a flat mop, it will sometimes sort of clip back anyway. So you've got a lot more protection. You don't have any sort of plasticky bits or edge bits that might potentially damage a wall or a ceiling or anything like that. So I do like this. It's a good idea. The other thing is, of course, it's got an extension handle so you can use it to reach places. And I could have even used that to, to get to the tops of, of cleaning um, the mirrors if I didn't have that other little device that I had. But anyway, watch me and you'll see how quick this is. So I um, pretty much in that one, one wash has gotten, gotten all the marks off that wall. I'm actually going to just rinse out my little thing and give it another go over. Um, and, um, but I actually, I don't know whether you could see in the video, but I could easily get the skirting boards on top of the skirting boards and over the skirting boards with this. Um, actually, I will just keep going so I can show you that I can then also get to places like this. <clears throat> Oops. 
down, you're always going to get plenty of marks around where the light switches are. to clean doors and things like that. Oops. So, as you can see, that only took a couple of minutes and I've cleaned quite a considerable part of the walls. Um, I need to move his bed out of the way so that I can get to the other parts um, and you know it's 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 quick it's really good these flat mops if you don't have one you really need to go and buy one because they are so useful and they're really good at getting in underneath furniture and things like that because they're so so slim okay they're also good to like to use if you've got highly um, polished uh, wooden floors where you might want to mop and clean the floors and then run over them with a dry flat mop just to get all the moisture off them so that they don't dry with any watermarks and they've got a really nice finish on them. So yes, they're very, very useful and I highly recommend it. So thank you for watching and keep, keep an eye out for the next part of cleaning this room. Exciting stuff, isn't it? Have a good day. <laughs>